say, what about this retreat was your favorite? I love the location because of the consistency of the climate and um, it's, it's refreshing, but it hasn't been um, crazy extremes. So that I think just makes everything workable. So the location is fabulous. Uh, yeah, I think my favorite thing was just the farm to table food and the meal prep. Um, really having just amazing choices and I felt like everything that we ate was incredibly flavorful. Um, left you feeling very satisfied. I never left any meal feeling hungry. Um, and just knowing that it came from across the street or from outside of our window, uh, to have that kind of like good, nutritious, nutrient dense food all the time. Um, just really changed my outlook on things that I'm gonna eat in the future. I think that's, like I was saying, the biggest thing I'm gonna take away from this. Like, I can see myself sitting down to dinner at home and saying, would this be something that we would have eaten on the retreat? Is this something that would have been approved um, on the retreat? And if it's not, then I know that I can make better choices where I can ask for substitutions or I can try and find um, something healthier to kind of stay in line with what we've been doing. Yeah. I think the workouts were my favorite because it was things I had never done before. So it was like a nice challenge, especially being like the start of the day, starting with that really positive workout, even if I sometimes hated it inside because it was challenging. But um, but it was great because I started my day off with a nice workout and feeling good. And it made me do things that I would never thought I could do or would do. And now I'm motivated to want to do more of it. Last one was body team training. Body team training. That was um, that was the most challenging for me, but during the process. But after we finished, like five minutes later, I thought, why was that so hard? I've done these things before. But it was the uh, the combination, the sand, the you know. Um, so that was that was a challenging one, but a good one. I would probably say the um, body hit on the beach yesterday uh, was probably my favorite, not at the time, but afterwards I definitely felt the best um, that I have felt in a long time after a workout and it felt really good to be outside and do something different. Um, being on the sand was really good, worked a lot of different muscles, so um, that was my favorite. After two days, the ones that we did on the sand, so it was the body hit, hit and then what was the other one? Body team training. Team training. Mm -hmm. Even though those were super difficult for me and I wanted to cry, I did really love them because I like pushing myself to do something that I normally would never do and I was afraid of doing it, but I actually really liked them. Now looking back in the moment, it was so, so hard, but afterwards, it was really nice to say, like, wow, I did that. Like, I would Huge not have accomplished it. Yeah, I normally wouldn't have done that on my own. So now I feel like, okay, I can do it. And maybe I can do more. And I can get better at it. It's awesome. Somebody who is kind of contemplating attending a fitness retreat. Um, I would say that you have, you have nothing to lose by doing it. I mean, I think... Um, the greatest thing about it is it's, and this is how I looked into, at it going into it, was it's a, an investment in myself, um, and it's something that I knew was going to at least give me a kickstart into putting me on a better path. I mean, there's no way that you can walk away from a fitness retreat and not take away something that you're going to incorporate into your, into your daily life. There's always room for improvement, and so um, I think, you know, if anybody's even thinking about doing it, if you're thinking about doing it, it means that you want to make some kind of significant change or some kind of even just small change. Um, and if it comes to your mind to do it, it means that there's a need out there um, for you to do it. And so you should absolutely do it. That's on my Snapchat. I guess you haven't seen them, but I did post like videos. I'm like, guys, if you ever are thinking of doing one of these, you need to do it. Um, I have always been interested in doing one of these retreats or doing something either like through yoga or meditation or working out or wellness, but just finding some sort of way to like better myself through one of these experiences. And it was worth every penny. It was worth every moment, you know, from being with you and having your personal attention to um, being with the ladies and just getting to know them and supporting each other. Uh, you know, it's interesting because I think we all had something to offer in the group and I posted on Facebook that like I felt like everyone in the group inspired me in a different way whether it's through fitness or spirituality or just life 
so learning from everyone and having that time together was really nice. Um, but yeah, I would recommend this to anybody that if someone even like has an inkling that they want to do it, I would say just do it.